So when you start the game, first you're just going to want to hit space because uh, no one has time for the cutscene. We're actually just going to immediately sprint into the neighbor's house and we're going to grab this flashlight here. And I personally like to um, head out the back, just move this chair just in case we ever need to come back out here. Um, we're just going to run over here and slam our body into this wall of boxes so we can grab this magnet. We're also going to grab a box here and we're just going to quickly chuck it out this window climb on in. Now at this point the neighbor doesn't really know how to do anything upstairs. He barely knows the upstairs place exists. See it looks like he's got here. He's currently trying to uh, bash down the gate which is um, kind of funny. Once you're at this point you're gonna want to just go ahead and open up this door. You want to make sure you kind of want to aim for this direction right here. You can't actually make it to that point so you actually kind of want to aim for that direction and then you also want to kind of you want to hold like W and A when you run across here. Um, no air strafing in this game, which is really dumb. Uh, we can just ditch the magnet because we don't need it anymore. Uh, the neighbor is trying to get us from down there. Uh, he can't get us, so from here we can just kind of walk and jump into this. He might actually be coming after us up here, but again, he doesn't really know the upstairs place exists. We can just drop down into this area right here where we can just drop the blue key, immediately grab the key card. Um, Grab this chair here, just move that to the side, grab this chair here, move it to the side. So this is going to open, but I personally like to um, go back and grab like a box or two. And using these boxes we can um, go across here, bash this window open. This window doesn't have like the proper jump in it, so I don't know why I choose this window every time. Uh, we bash that open. At that time, the neighbor knows I exist though now, so I'm just gonna. You kind of wanna, so you kind of just wanna leap into this window, do the same thing you did at like the uh, weird floorless room. Just grab the gun, move this chair out of the way. And now you're just back here. Um, and finally, we're gonna go cr try grabbing the crowbar. So what most people would try to do is they would uh, grab some boxes and they'll kind of just stack it up so they can get in here. Uh, what we're actually gonna do is we're just gonna go ahead and run up to this rail. We're just going to kind of hold W and kind of sprint. When you get up to this point, you kind of just want to move your camera. You don't want to jump or anything. Just move the camera. And then now we just kind of have the crowbar. You can just shoot this window open. And we're basically good to go. Yeah, it looks like the neighbor's kind of stuck. Let's see if he ever gets unstuck. Nah, he's just kind of stuck like that forever. Key card first, because that's always the uh, fastest thing to do. And you kind of just want to spam click looking on these boards here. And you can just open it up and you can just head right on in. So we can see the neighbors like crying and stuff. And just, like, you can climb up onto this chair and shoot out his windows, and you actually can see him tapping his foot impatiently there, because this is the um, same animation that he uses in Alpha One. Uh, so at this point, what you're gonna want to do is um, climb onto this couch and initiate a flying kick with the neighbor. And congratulations, you've just beaten Hello Neighbor Alpha Three.